The Holcomb Honor Choir provided the wonderful setting for today's celebration of Dr. King's life, a man who said he had a dream about the advancement of equal rights around this country. Dr. King's vision is playing out here at home. Judge Wood is the first African-American Washington County judge ever, and he says he's ready for the challenge. We really got some things going. We're going to be looking at making improvements to drive out a, a better county with the uh, infrastructure that we're looking at, strategy around that, uh, the destination education, as well as getting around the county and making sure we're safe and secure. He said Dr. King's life of service is one we can all benefit from still today. The rising star in the Republican Party of Arkansas spent his first few years of his life in an orphanage. His adoptive parents stressed hard work and education along with serving the community. And the more people you serve, the greater leader you become. And he responded briefly to the controversy around his decision to change out some management personnel from the formerly Democratic judge. We went through the process and we went through the, uh, the policies and here's where we are. We selecting a good team. We got retained 95 percent of the employees uh, or even more than that. Winners of the essay contest for this event that's run some 15 years now were announced and reading those essays spoke to everyone in attendance. It always seems to me that it's so important to them to learn about their history and they really take a lot away from it. And he said, do not fight with hands, do not fight. You should just, you fight with love. The words of a child, which we can all listen to tonight. The top three winners of the essay contest were awarded cash prizes by Arvest.